Mitochondria. Whack. Endoplasmic reticulum. Whack. Prokaryotes. Whack. Nucleus. Whack. Golgi apparatus. Whack. Lysosomes and peroxisomes. Whack. Cell wall. Type. The cell, our home, and the place we love. A place full of fun, laughter, excitement. A place of beauty, natural beauty. Our cell is a busy metropolis full of wonder and delight for all to see and enjoy. Our cell is important. Our cell is productive. Our cell is our identity. And we need to make sure we have the right strong leaders to keep our cell great, the way it is. We know what happens when we put the wrong leaders in place, when we put the spiders, the organelles just in it for the power and the title. We've seen what happens when we put in weak leaders, leaders who can't protect the cell the way it deserves. Leaders who bring chaos, death, and destruction to the cell we love. Leaders who open the gates to the pathogens, to the diseased, to the infected, leaving our precious cell vulnerable to the terrifying and dangerous world outside. These leaders can't be trusted. Leaders like the mitochondria and chloroplast, weak, hateful, unfit for our cell. The mitochondria and chloroplast only care about power and will do nothing to stop pathogens from invading our cell. The Golgi complex <laughs> may package proteins, but they are the real packages of trash. Day to day you can see the Golgi complex packaging up proteins and exporting molecules for use out of the cell. We need an organelle and leader that can stay domestic and help build our economy and environment here, rather than spending our resources on external affairs that don't help ourselves. Just as bad are the endoplasmic reticulum and ribosomes who help facilitate the exportation of our products and resources out of the cell like parasites. Prokaryotes are old and out of style. They're unicellular and don't work well with other organelles. They're unpredictable with mutations. They've been around for so long and have done nothing for the cell. Nothing to keep our cells safe from the outside. They've had their chance. We need real, decisive leaders. The nucleus and nucleolus are totalitarian. They care about nothing except their own opinion. They don't care about protecting the cell. And in the cell, we're a democracy, not a one organelle system. Lysosomes and peroxisomes are the janitors and trash collectors of our cell. Although they're important, they just don't have the sophistication, ability, or knowledge to perform the role of a strong leader, and certainly they don't have the experience or strength to regulate the cell the way it deserves to be. There's clearly only one organelle that can be elected and trusted for the job, and it's the cell wall. All the other organelles have gimmicks and frivolous reasons to try and elicit your vote. With the cell wall, the reason you should vote is for your safety, our safety, and the cell's safety. Together we are strong. We are the backbone and structure of this cell, regulating what comes in and comes out. We know what should stay out. Keep our cell clean and pure. Keep out the infection, the disease, the filth. Keep out illegal pathogens. Keep our cell a place that we are proud to identify with. Protect our culture, our metropolis, our cell, and vote cell wall. Let's make this cell great. Wong Productions.